Welcome to today's encouragement from Our Daily Bread. I'm Elisa Morgan, and I titled today's reading, The Pink Coat. Brenda was walking toward the mall exit when a flush of pink from a display window caught her eye. She turned and stood spellbound before a cotton candy-colored coat. Oh, how her friend Holly would love it! Finances had been tight for her co-worker friend, who was a single mother. And while Brenda knew Holly needed a warm coat, she was also confident that her friend would never lay down cash on such a purchase for herself. After wavering ever so slightly, Brenda smiled, reached for her wallet, and arranged for the coat to be shipped to Holly's home. She added an anonymous card, You are so very loved. Brenda practically danced to her car. Joy is a byproduct of God-nudged giving. As Paul instructed the Corinthians in the Art of Generosity in 2 Corinthians chapter 9, he said, Each of you should give what you have decided in your heart to give, not reluctantly or under compulsion, for God loves a cheerful giver. He also noted, Whoever sows generously will also reap generously. Sometimes we slip cash into the offering plate. At other times, we donate online to a worthy ministry. And then there are moments when God leads us to respond to the need of a friend with a tangible expression of His love. We offer a bag of groceries, a tank of gas, or even the gift of a perfectly pink coat. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verses 6 through 9. Remember this, whoever sows sparingly will also reap sparingly, and whoever sows generously will also reap generously. Each of you should give what you have decided in your heart to give, not reluctantly or under compulsion, for God loves a cheerful giver. And God is able to bless you abundantly, so that in all things, at all times, having all that you need, you will abound in every good work. As it is written, they have freely scattered their gifts to the poor. Their righteousness endures forever. Let's pray. Loving Father, you gave us the gift of your Son. So we want to give to others. May we respond to your gentle nudge to meet the needs of another. Thank you, Lord. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks for listening today. My name is Elisa Morgan, and today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.